Hi, today is February 13th, 2023, and here are my poems for the day. The first one is poem number 262 for the year, The Island. The intensity was too much for them, and they closed their eyes for many days, and when that was not enough, they walked, and then they ran, and then they swam to the island about a quarter mile away. There were coconuts and berries and various seaweeds, and they were able to thrive for many months. Once they had sensed that the intensity had passed, they returned to the mainland and got on with their life. But from that point on, they returned to the island at least once a year, not because the intensity had returned, but because they had come to really love the island. Poem number 263, Still Making Mistakes. I asked her whether the art director was a he or a she, and of course the answer was what I didn't say. They are a they, she said. I still think it should be they is a they, but I was so mortified at having not asked the question in a modern 21st century way that I just moved on. Actually, I kind of slunk off. I still think it should be I kind of slunked off, but whatever, I slunk off metaphorically, while continuing on with the conversation. Because what can you say after making such a blunder? What fucking year is it that I am still making mistakes like that? Poem number 264, Nothing to Do. More than a few people have fucked me over recently. If you are one of them, that doesn't mean that this is about you. It could be about that other one, or that other one, or that other one who fucked me over. It could be that this has nothing to do with you, so get over yourself. Don't make me have to go all Carly Simon on your ass. Just get over yourself. Poem number 265, Standing Offer. Because 95% of the time, I'm not thinking about you at all. And the other 5%, I still don't want to write about you. When I think about you, I usually don't even want to be thinking about you. And I certainly don't want to write about you. It's not like I'm Taylor Swift and you're Harry Styles, even if I knew you were trouble when you walked in. Although, are they back together now? If so, Harry Styles is clearly no Jake Gyllenhaal. Anyway, before I knew you, you were no nobody to me. Now you will never be nobody again. That's how it goes. Once somebody is somebody, they can never be nobody again. So you will never be nobody again, even though we are never, ever, ever getting back together. But let me change the subject and remind you that I have a long memory. And this one, just like the last one, could very well about be about someone I met long before you, or long after. So again, get over yourself. Or at the very least, consider this standing offer. You are cordially invited to stay out of my shit and stop reading my fucking poems. Poem number 266, As They Did. I'd like to close my eyes for several days, as they did. Not because of the intensity, but to see what I might see. I'd like to swim to a nearby island, as they did. Not to get away, but to see if I could make it. I'd like to spend some time on Governor's Island before it all gets before it gets all fucked up with construction. And then I'd like to come back and close my eyes for a while before I get all fucked up with whatever is going to fuck me up. I don't think I can do exactly as they did, and I don't think I want to, but I appreciate their example. I appreciate that they did as they did. Okay, that's it. Under four minutes. Whoa. Um, thank you for your attention. If you were paying attention, I never know, do I? Don't know what you're doing while I'm doing this. Anyway, thank you. I do appreciate it.